Anyway, now we've got a parrot mission because Adeline wants us to get her something. It's a flower. What a cow. Anyway, that's what you've got to do because it ba basically it bounces. And then Tom can just do that. Nice and simple. But I do remember getting really confused at doing some of them because I tried to do it myself. My god, it's too annoying to try and figure it out. Hoo hoo, hoo hoo, hoo hoo, hoo hoo. Don't take that laugh off her, please. It's a hideous laugh. Oh, what have you remembered, Professor? You get! Just stop forgetting her! It's just evil! Anyway, let's talk to Minnie here. I, already, I thought we'd already talked to Minnie. She gave us that cookie one. Didn't she? Oh well. Uh, she's, she's got nice chocolate ones. She's, she's the foodie of the game. Just like we had what's his face in Curious Village. Prosciutto. However you say it. But. Now, basically, this is where it gets quite fun, because you can cut it up to help from out there, and then you can cut it so that you just miss the bit in the middle, so you can get eight. Hmm, does this sound right? Wee! I want to grab, but that was pretty great. No, it wasn't, Flora. Co correct. Oh my god. That is awful. Oh, thanks for the chocolate, Duck. Everybody loves a bit of chocolate. And now we have another parrot request. God, we're just stacking these up. So it's a homemade cake. Basically that'll bounce him onto that one and that'll bounce him up to there. There we go. All sorted. It was quite difficult, yes. Oh, you made a pot of Earl Grey. I don't like Earl Grey. I'm only I'm, I'm a breakfast tea person. That's that's the only type of tea I like. Breakfast tea, no proper tea. Earl Grey's just sort of a bit too ooh, for my taste. Here we brought Flora along, Becky. Is that all right? Not babble, ramble. Get it correct, Flora. <laughs> Everybody thinks the worst of you, you gits. Leaving the poor girl to fend for herself in London. How very dare you, Professor. <laughs> oh, look, shut up, do it, you're a gentleman. Ho hopefully we won't need to sleep. Hopefully we can get this all done today. Actually, we might be able to do that, you know. <laughs> yes, we're time travellers now. 
we, we, we travel through time. Like the Doctor, except we don't travel through space. Yes, it is quite convoluted. But... Eh, we'll deal with it. Yes, this is true. Then again, a future Flora might have moved away. That's another worrying suggestion. Because although Flora might have moved, future Flora might have moved away, I can't see her leaving Luke. Considering Luke's like, oh, it's Dean Delmona. What are you doing here, mate? That means something important. Right? Yeah... Something is the matter, but, um... We'll deal with it later. The future Dean Delmona. We decided to go and find Shipley at the restaurant in order to make contact with future Luke. On the way, we stopped at the hotel so that I could explain our, situ our situation to Flora, but she still seems blissfully unaware of the danger we're in. I do hope she'll be alright. On our way out, we'd met Dean Delmona, whose hair is now white as snow. Quite a nice, um... Your image there. Kind of odd referring to a man in that way, but so well. No. Let's go talk to Shipley. We need to find... Oh no, we need to talk to this, um, family thug first. Oh, we'll solve it with ease, mate. 056, five stamps. What's the lowest possible number of stamps you can use to make a correct thing with one stamp? Well, it's three and Here's six. Because you can use the three and stamp it twice. I knew it. Backwards to make an eight. Oh no, it's 333, three, three, and then you turn the 6 around to make a 9. Silly me. Oh. Luke, run. Run for your life, boy. Hey, up Shipley, how you doing, mate? Where's future Luke? Oh, okay. The observatory in the park that's to the north. Okay, I think we know where. We shall get there quickly. Always listening. Excellent. We'll probably be a group of four shortly. do it. That is also true. Do you remember the last time we left her by herself? She got um, kidnapped, thrown in a barn and had D Don Paolo pretend to be her for most of the game and we didn't even realise. Well, I realised. Because clearly I was more than the professor. But, um, yeah. Shouldn't quite leave Flora alone. Rejoining Future Luke. According to Shipley, Future Luke is waiting for us in the park observatory north of the restaurant. He told us to make sure we're not followed, but I suspect it's too late for that. I'm certain that someone has already been watching us make our way around the town. 
That doesn't matter for now, though. We've decided we have to meet up with Future Luke and decide our next step. Yes, indeed. I do believe Payard will pay hard as a puzzle for us. No, I haven't noticed this before, but Jesus Christ, he's got a whopper of a moustache. Anyway, 057, Miss Painted Plates. Right. Send back the ones that are impossible to use. Well. Six and nine are impossible to use. Let's see the if others I've got you this can right. sort of just turn round to make them right. Just as I suspected. So, yes, and since the others are symmetrical, they just have to do six and nine. Way! Do love a bit of gravy. Way, we have another parrot mission. We're just racking these up. We have seemed to stop getting cars. The toy car missions. Now that's why you put that rope there, because it makes him bounce just a little bit forward. So that means that you can get up onto the other one. Now I think there are multiple ways of doing the puzzles, but these are the easiest ones. Tomato. Well, at least you said tomato, but not tomato. Because this isn't an American version of the game, it's the English version. The better version, mind you. <laughs> oh god, shall we stop harassing people? You're not going to get these things answered any quicker. It has no authority anymore, you do, you do realise this, Inspector. <laughs> Inspector, stop it. Stop it now. He's reading a paper. He's not dubious. You do realise this, don't you, Inspector? So he, he kind of looks like Humpty Dumpty, if you know what I mean. Bye, Inspector. It's fine, Dupree. It's fine. The guy's easily worked up. And a bit of a nutter. Run away from Belle. She creeps me out. Anyway, here is the observatory. Not another locked door puzzle thing. What is it with people and their obsession with these locked door puzzles? 058, Gravity Maze. Oh no, this one's quite fun. Rotate the table to um, chain, move the blocks about to get them into the right position. Quite fun, I do love Let's them. Let's see if I've got this right. Well, that's one thing that Lost Future did you really well. It added a like number a of salt. different puzzle types. It was really, really, really fun. Yes, we did it in five. Thank you. Because we are smart. Now, let's go see Future Luke, hey? There he is. Now, time for our chass. <laughs> 